Hey guys, this is Gavin Bays, and this is my TQA groundwork in phase one video for a uh, horse I'm starting for Bradford. TQA is a non-profit organization focused on working with experts in the equine and ranching industry to set industry quality standards and certifications in training and selling horses to the public. The first task we score on is how good the horse was to catch. In this video, I would score this horse a positive two because he stands well, but in order to get a three, I feel like he should have lowered his head more. Next, we score on stage one. Stage one is when we ask our horses to stop their inside front foot and move the other three feet forward around it. I scored him a positive two on this task. After these two tasks, we focus on horizontal direction. There are eight signs that show us if our horses have horizontal direction. The first four are by the pole. We look to see if the horse is breaking the pole horizontally, has his nose beneath his eye, his ear should stay flat, his head should not tilt, and you should not see any white in his eyes. The last four are of the loin. Again, we look to see if the horse's front and hind feet are traveling the same path as his nose, if his outside hind steps out, his inside hind steps up and under his navel, if the pole and the loin make a C-shape around the flag or the rider's leg, then being able to ride a perfect circle. If the horse has all eight of these things, we know they have good horizontal direction. I would score this horse a 1, because he does it pretty well, but it takes him a little while to get on that nice curved line. After that, we test their stage 1 into stage 2. Stage 2 is when the horse's hindquarters pull them in reverse motion. I would score this horse a 1, because he does it pretty well, but not perfect. After stage 2, we ask for stage 1 again and then for stage 3. Stage 3 is the lateral movement of the front end and hind feet together. Today I would have scored him a 2 because he does this task pretty well. Final stage we teach our horses stage 4. Stage 4 is when we ask our horses to stop their inside hind leg and move the rest of their feet forward around it. I would score him a 1 in this task because he does it well but he doesn't quite do it as smooth as I would like him to Our next task is leading with going submission. The definition of pulling submission is after initial cue, the horse performs the task on a loose ring with no leg pressure. I would have scored this horse a 1 because he is a little hesitant. Our final task in this groundwork phase is picking up their feet. This horse is awesome about his feet, so I would score him a 2. This horse stood well while I saddled and bridled him, so for these maneuvers, I would score him a positive two.
After bridling, I went back to our grammar phase and asked for horizontal direction in and away from me, as well as stage one. Today, I would have scored him a two for these tasks. The next clip is of him standing while I get on. Most days this horse stands really good for me to get on, but on this particular video day he was a little bit antsy, so I will score him a 2. After I am on, we work on horizontal direction in stage 1 again. After this we score on their ability to double on a walk, a trot, and a lope. For all of these tasks, I would score him a 3. We always want a horse to double in 3 or less steps if possible. <laughs> oh, that's what my colt does. Next, we score our horses on the house after they move out into a lope. With this task, I would score this horse at two. The final task we score on in phase one is their stage two, standing. For this task, I would give this horse a positive three. We also score our horses on their temperament. Looking back at the score sheets, you can see that we score them on their level of self-preservation, their confidence, their energy, how willing they are, their reaction to social separation, and how sensitive they are to pressure. For self-preservation, I would score this horse a 1. For confidence, I would score this horse a 2. For energy, I would score this horse a 1. For willingness, I would score this horse a 0. For reaction to social separation, I would score this horse a negative 2. Finally, for sensitivity, I would score this horse a 1. Thank you.